Hey there, I want to show you how you can change your VTX channels on your transmitter. Before we get started, you should know that you need ELRS uh, protocol on your transmitter and also an ELRS receiver on your drone to get this done. You also need a VTX that supports smart audio and tramp uh, telemetry. Uh, you also need to go in the beta flight and change some things. So let's hop in the beta flight and do that real quick. All right, so once you're in beta flight, you just go over to the ports tab and then whatever tab you have set up on your uh, smart audio or uh, tramp t telemetry. Uh, usually it's like a UR1 or 2 or 3. You would uh, go onto uh, the UR you put it on and then you would select tramp or smart audio, depending on what your uh, VTX is. You also need to go to the VTX table and make sure that it's correct to your VTX. They're all different. I would, I, I usually just hand input it most of the time, which takes forever, but it works. You also need to go to the receivers tab and make sure that, you know, for ELR, ELRS serial and then uh, crossfire and then telemetry. You gotta have that uh, telemetry uh, check marked for this to work. <clears throat> After that, you just save the settings, reboot, and you should be good to go. Next, we'll go to the uh, table, and I'll show you how it's done on the controller. All right, so we're here at the desk, and we are going to change our VTX channel with our remote. And the first thing you gotta do is load the Lua script inside your transmitter. So open up ELRS, it loads the script. You should be able to scroll down and see VTX admin. Right now I have it on R1 and whenever I plugged in my drone, it automatically went to channel one on my uh, receiver here. So um, I will now do, I'll now change it. So let's change it to R3. And then once you click send the VTX, it will uh, send it to the VTX here. So now my drone is on R3. I'm gonna switch the receiver here to R3. There we go. So let's unplug the drone real quick. All right, now let's change it to R1 again. And let's go ahead and just send uh, send that to the drone. Make that in focus. Let's go ahead and send that to the drone. So now whenever I plug in the drone, it should come up on R1. So this screen should not have anything on it. It started to come up on R3, then it got the signal from the controller and it switched over to R1. So let's go to R1 and make sure. This is going to take a second. There we go. So yeah, so that's how you set up, fuck. That's how you set up VTX admin on your ELRS controller. Thank you for watching and subscribe.